What do you think about Bronny? He'll figure it out. Sarah Canyon Legends. Let me ask you, let me ask you again. <laughs> what do you think about Bronny? As a basketball player? As a basketball player. Personally, I think I think he understands the game. Like my dad played, so I understood the game at a young age. So I mean, now people are worried about like, oh, he's he's not shooting the ball well or whatever. Like that's gonna come. Right. Like so, I think he has like all the intangibles. He can shoot the ball. He can defend. He's strong and he's athletic, and that's what teams want. And he's still only 19 years old. When you came in, did you feel like you needed more experience um, playing after after your first I, experience in like the atmosphere of it, like your rookie year? Did um, you feel like, man, I could have used a little bit more experience? No. Feel like he was ready? Yes. It was. Just, it just took. It just took me time to like figure it out, like the NBA side. Yes. Got it. Like, I remember my first game, like, I get in the game, I'm like, God damn, this shit moving so fucking fast. Mm-hmm. Like, what the fuck? Like, my preseason game. And then I think probably we were playing the Hawks. And who was on my – Victor Oladipo was on Rockets still. Mm-hmm. He, he was on the left wing. He came down. I was on the same side corner. He dumped it off to me, and I like, dunked John Collins. And once I did it, I was like, all right, like, Bet, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm here now. I'm here, so, yeah. no, it's just like having those moments, like, once you, you know what I'm saying, dunk on somebody or- Get you know, that shit off your chest. You, you feel me? You can yeah. relax. And you're yeah, like, all right, yeah. bet, like, now it's time got to go. It, got so, it, yeah. That's what I feel like with him. Like, he's going to figure it out. I think people just put too much on his shoulders just based off LeBron. Yep. And you got to understand that people don't understand that they're two different people. Well, that's why I asked you the question, because you, you got a father that yeah, played, right? For sure. Y'all didn't get to play together or none yeah. of that, you know? But you still got a story. So coming from somebody like you, having you know an opinion on a player, I think everybody gets kind of scared to answer these questions based on who it is mm-hmm. and why it is and the time it is. But we still hoopers, bro. It ain't like criticism to just tell you somebody like oh, this is what I think about him. I think he got this type of game. I think he need a little bit more time. And once mm-hmm. he get this time, he gonna be good. For sure. Yeah. I that's think, that's my thing with Bronny. Yeah. It's always like experience. Like, that's all it is. Once yeah. he gets it. He got the body frame, he got the skill set, and he, he got time. And he's, that's what I say, he's 19. Like, you can't, people expect him to come and go to summer league and average 30. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, that's not. Like, if you look across the board and look at some of the other rookies, 0 for 8, someone was 1 for 12. Like, it, it's, it's not college. Yeah. Right. Your college resume has no input on this. At all. Right? It's a very different sport. The game is slower. It's, yeah, and then you can stand in the paint like this and don't move. No three, yeah. no three seconds. You can no sit in the corner, do all like th- this is different. You're moving. So even the threes, this three is further than it was before. Now he has to adjust to this three. Right? That is just unless you're just a pure shooter, it's gonna be hard for you to adjust. It's gonna take some time. Yeah, because it's different in college if he's shooting a college three. Like a couple, oh, he hit two threes, and then he take a couple steps back, and he had an NBA three, and he made it. No, yeah. because he was shooting the college threes, yeah. and he got his rhythm to step back. <laughs> yeah. But now it's yeah. just you have to get adjusted. Where every time, every you're time. shooting an NBA three, yeah, yeah. Like I just never seen so much like like he go shoot a suspect. shot off the backboard, and then somebody else will go shoot off the shot off the backboard, and y'all not gonna say anything about him, but mm-hmm. you wanna say something about him, like yeah. it's I, like it's like the the expectations of. Uh, a second round pick is just ridiculous because they're using metrics that's not even is real. It's not real. Like at and this is how you know a narrative. They have him the fifty fifth pick. They never signed a guaranteed contract. Why are you narrowing it down to that fucking number? How about just say second round? How many second rounders signed four year guarantees? Three of them last year. One was the last pick in the NBA draft. Right, he's on the four-year deal for seven. There's three people in this year's draft that signed four-year guarantee deals, but you, you try to narrow it down to his his numbers so you can make him look bad. Yeah. But no, he's not the highest-paid player in the second round. There's other players, but because second round no one knows about him, there's no coverage on him. It's easy to just point him out. It's like he's a second-round pick. What do you expect? I expect him to play. Maybe 10 to 17 games this year. 
right? He'll probably get in 10 to 17 games, average half a point to one point, like every other second goddamn round pick. But the, right? hey, but, <laughs> That's the, it. It's like, but the expectation is not on him being a second round pick. But it is. That's, but it's not. It is. The expectation not. for him that like he could have get he could have went anywhere in the draft. No, he's a second round pick. But but if he doesn't, let's say he doesn't get drafted, he still has an expectation if he makes a squad because yeah, you're LeBron man. James' yeah, but son. It, but it's but it doesn't me, matter where do he's. Pick. But to me that like. That's his dad, but that has nothing to do with it, though. It has everything. I don't think so. Because wherever he goes, because that's like me saying, like when I came in, like oh, like everything I do is be like because it, like no, that doesn't make sense. No, but it's because of him that your name is going to be remembered from other people on the outside because we don't know your. You can't expect him to go play like LeBron James. We have that's the expectation. No, No, it's not. That's fucked up. It is. is. I mean, mean, that's his son. At what level? That's what I, people are expecting. At the level, at the, but that's, that's what I'm saying. Like if you're, Michael you're, Jordan's son got to the NBA, they expect his. But, son yeah. to play like but so Jordan. who's who, who's in who's right? who's the problem yeah. then? Is he the problem yeah. for playing like a no. second round pick or yeah. or a rookie? Or the problem is the media trying to make this seem yeah. like he's LeBron James? That's I mean, like, media. Like he didn't get picked number one. Like he's playing better than some of the first round picks. Yeah, but you know how like the that's media. The, that's the sad part. Elijah has an expectation. For sure, he does. Because you're his dad. Period. Point blank. That, and he's he's gonna he's gonna answer those expectations because he's been trained and he's good enough. The same way you you had an expectation because your dad is your dad and you came in playing similar to your dad. Well, he's he. What I'm gonna say, he played what three summer league games? Like, three summer league, yes. Three summer. And he, he still took has twenty six shots. I'm like shit. I didn't get twenty three. Sh- I didn't get twenty six shots up in my. I didn't get twenty six shots up. In my whole summer league experience as a fr- as a rookie, he's just figuring it out. <laughs> is it a, is it an unfair Shit. expectation? Yes, it's an unfair expectation. That's but that's life. But though. is it an expectation? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, was... For but that, sure. But that makes but that's what the, it makes life. everybody else seem uneducated then, because if you're expecting a second round pick to somehow be like his father, something's wrong with you, right? Who Jetter? Like 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 coming like like, like I'm saying. As a second round pick, 2022 draft, right? So just two drafts ago, there was 29 picks. Six of them didn't even make the team. Eight of them didn't even make it to the second year. That means the second round pick, there's only 15 players that are actually still in the league. That is what is required of a second round pick. So you're trying to make this kid be LeBron James no. is ridiculous. No, no, no. How many of those second round picks were making seven million dollars in college? Seven million dollars in college? Mm-hmm. Or, I mean, no. How many second round picks got a in, guaranteed they didn't contract? Have, well, they didn't have that in, in. college. Yeah, they didn't have NIL, that. NIL, and you were making seven million dollars. They didn't have that. They didn't have that. They didn't have that year. Right. So that's why the expectation. It just started is, that summer after my trip. Right? What? Yeah. The NIL started the summer of the, uh, the 2020, damn, you know, 2022. Or 20, let me see. So if you look at it, the expectation is coming from, okay, you was a freshman in college. We know who you are. You go to USC. You was a McDonald's All-American. Mm-hmm. You have pressure on you already at USC. But 2021 has started. The heart problem, the heart situation uh, eases the pressure off him because it's like, all right, we got to wait till he come back. Let's see if he can get back to regular form. He plays the whole freshman year. He's still NIL deal. Then you leave your freshman year. You feel like you're ready to go. That's even more was pressure. That, was that ready to go? Or was that circumstances that made him think that I want to go? Well, coach, coach gets I mean, people like, it's circumstance. Like, I, I don't think no one's taking in the circumstances of this. The hard thing changed the mindset of him, the mindset of that family, right? Think about we've played, right? Bron has been in the game 20 years. Bronny's 19 years old. That means half of the year he's away from his kids, right? For the first time in his career, something happened to one of his children, his firstborn. Now he knows every single 365 days, his son is right next to him. Mm-hmm. This is this is beyond basketball, right? So he gets to Wake up, eat breakfast, eat lunch, eat dinner, go to the movies, ride the bus, fly on the plane, watch film every single day. Something he's never done before. 
right? This is more of I, I, someone just, someone just passed that was this close to me, and I'm gonna hang out with the motherfucker every single day. That's what this 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 is really about, right? For for them, Ronnie, I just want to play. Shit, I almost lost my life. Fuck that. I want to play basketball. I don't give a fuck if it's in Spain, Egypt. I just want to just. Can I just play? Right? This is not a, like we putting so much on it because it's it's who it is, but not understand their circumstances changed, and we can't look at it the same way that we're looking at. It. We got to look at it like anybody. If we can get our loved one back, that's someone that passed. And we can spend time, we're going to drop everything and spend time with him. Well, he can't drop his career, so he added, come on. But it's not the first time this type of situation has happened. To who? To a player. This happened before. Sharif O'Neal. Sharif had a hard situation. Sharif didn't get to go into the draft. Shaq told him to stay back and go to school, get some more experience. You ain't ready for this. Similar numbers. Well, Shaq ain't playing. I know Shaq not playing, so that's what. But but remember what remember remember what the narrative was. It was we've never had this conversation to even do this. But what I'm saying is Shaq, but Shaq can see his son every day. Of course, Shaq can soak soak in. Oh, you see his son when he on the West Coast on the East Coast uh, trip. Why not? When he's gone for 18 days, son can go with him. Back playing in college, I can't. I can't get that phone. Like I, I don't want that phone call again. Think about this, it's a phone call. It's not that it happened in the, this is a phone call, not LA practice. I'm wherever I am and I got a phone call, right? So that's what I'm saying, it changes. So we can't look at it as, we got to look at it like, I give it two years, let's see where it happens, right? You got, this is something that, you know, that is different, right? But if we all just take ourselves out of the basketball aspect of it and say, all right, think of what we would do if someone near us almost lost their life. And we always say we will spend every day with that yeah, person. Yeah, it depends on who it is. But is that the story? Someone, a loved one. No, I'm saying someone depends, you love. It, it depends on who it is. No, I'm I'm someone you love. love. It depends on who it is. But is that the story? I might line? not love you like that. Is that I said, that's why I said someone you love, nigga. No. <laughs> is that the storyline, though? Like, is the storyline to play no, with my the... father? Is it to play with my father in the NBA? Or is it that I want to seize the moment? And be no, able to take advantage no, the story, of the moment. No, no, both. no. Both. It's, theirs is both. There's, like that's what I said. You got to think about his dream. His dream is what? Playing I wanted NBA. to get. I wanted to play in the NBA. I want to get my name called. And LeBron dream boy to play with his okay. son. Okay. Yeah. So, so, so I. So that's what you want, son? Okay. I, I'll get your name called. So, but that, let's not act like the, he wasn't going to be on the Lakers if he didn't get picked. But if he get, not, but think about. If by he didn't the, get picked, he would have signed a contract with the Lakers. No, if he another. Goes, yeah, team, yeah, he would have no, signed. the question is if he if another team picks him up. No, he would have. They said, they said he was in Australia. But they, then, oi, oi, oi. so what are we talking about at that point? If you just want to make it to the NBA and you don't want to play on no other team but this team, yeah. we talking about no, something talking totally. About that. but that's what the report said. We don't know if that's but, true. But, right, but it's still right. two, it's two different narratives. He just wants to get drafted. At this point, he don't give a fuck where it's at. The father's like, I want my son next to me right. for the next year. Right. So, you know, they, they got two narratives going on. And obviously, Bron's narrative is going to trump it. But if he didn't get drafted, he was going to be on the Lakers. I don't even know why people are acting like, oh, they could have picked somebody else at the 55th pick. I'm Whoever, who got picked after uh, Bronny? Good question. Because I know he got traded to the Knicks. Let me pull it up. Because whoever that, whoever 55, whoever 56 is, he should be happy Bronny got picked 55. Because if he got Kevin picked. Kevin McCullough Jr. Who? Kevin McCuller Jr. So Kevin, if Ke- if they didn't pick Bronny and uh, the Lakers pick Kevin, right now, Kevin will be getting his ass cut because <laughs> they need to make room for Bronny, and yeah. now Kevin <laughs> don't have a chance to make an NBA roster. His ass would be overseas. So Kevin's lucky yeah. because he would have been getting cut for Bronny. So question is, are they, <laughs> did they draft Bronny to consider him as an asset for the future, or did they draft yeah. Bronny for LeBron? A little bit of both. He's like, how many years you been in the league? This is my fifth year. How old are you? 23. 23. What year did you get drafted? 2020. So that means five years from now, Bronny would be on T23. Literally the same thing. It is literally the same thing. So I get it. I'm just asking. We're going to see what, but at 22 and 23, we can see where the developments came from. Because we know right now, the guys who are getting drafted at 23, we know what they look like. I'm not refuting that at all. I'm saying the decision to draft him. Was it, was it 
we see Bronny being a fit for the Lakers yeah. and helping us win sure. X, Y, Z, yeah. or helping. There's no, pick. there's no expectations on there's him. There's no expectation. He's fifty fifth pick to play well this year. None whatsoever. There, hey yo, hey, yo I, 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 I agree. I agree that there's no expectations. Not even next year. There's nothing. Like so not he's even a 55th next year. Pick. We're not expecting him to do nothing. So what nothing. about what about the boy? Uh, what's his name? Dal Dalton Dayton. Dalton. Dalton, Dalton, Dalton. What about him? Yeah, he's expected to come in and, 17, and help a little bit. pick. He's a seventeen pick. That's twenty three years old. And he's an old man. He's. I don't expect him to come in and change our our franchise. Twenty three. Yeah. I expect him to come in, hit some shots up, and you know, make some shots and you know, open the floor. But I don't expect him You're to same come age. in here and average 17 points. That's wild. He just had 20, he, he had 29, though. right? I, he I just had 29. Him, I, I expect, expect him to be ready to play. 20 20 25, 25, yeah, 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 that's what he's he, supposed to do. Is he? Yes. yes. You're 23. You're 23. <laughs> because he's 23, he's yes. supposed to. Yes. Because he's 23. And that's yo, how it is now. KJ, I got it. Remember that's. Wait, wait, wait. How old is Reed Shepard? Are you 19? Yeah, is he supposed to do that? Yeah, he's a number three pick. Number two three. picks. Is he supposed to do that? Yes. yes. He's a first, he was a freshman. He's 20 years old. He's a freshman. He just turned 20 he in June. He was a top three but pick, I can, though. But he, I can tell he, you. He came off the bench. But I can tell you this. Team. No, no, I can tell you this. If he don't play well this this, this rookie year, it's okay. Who cares? Because he's only 20. But he's a top, top three pick. So he's a top three pick. He's still, like, expected to play well. But if not, okay, it's fine. Like the, like the, so the, the number guys, one castle. So what are you guys expecting? Huh? So what are you guys expecting? From him? From, who? From Bronny. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Show up and work out, work on your game. <laughs> go, Daddy, go! Go, Daddy, go! That's my daddy! Hey, soon as they nah, saw me, soon as they saw me, uh, 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 Go, Daddy, uh, go! Uh, go, uh, Daddy, uh, go! Hey, what, you, what you need? All right, let me go get your towel, let me get your water. <laughs> sit there. That's time. Hey, sit, hey, hey, sit <laughs> there, Daddy, learn the plays, talk to the coach. That, that, yes! Don't talk to my daddy like that. It's a second round pick. What you expect him to learn, no. understand, be word. cheerful, be a great. But he's question. gonna be that anyway. <laughs> I got a question. So, so <laughs> right? Like what? So, are you only agreeing with this because you was a second round pick? I was second too. I was second. What? So, so I'm just saying, like, no, you being biased? Like, no, 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 what no, I'm saying no, no, no. Well, I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out what I'm trying to figure out. I, and I fuck with Brian. I fuck with the whole situation. It's, it's cool and all. But what I'm saying is, so like, are like, what is your problem with what the media is saying and, and how they're viewing it? Because is it because he's LeBron James' son, and it because no. like because everybody else is in that position? Because, like, cause, I mean, well, I got, I mean, I'm speaking for myself too. Because if I have kids, would am I gonna feel this way, or because, I'm gonna just tell that young because, nigga, you ain't like that, so because, you ain't like that. But no, so, no, like, no, you know, no, no, I'm just trying, I'm just trying no, to figure no, no, out. No, no, no. The like, problem what is this. Is. That's what you say now. No, the problem I, is this. I don't care, nigga. You You're, ain't good enough, nigga. Okay. Good enough yeah, to do what? I don't care if it's my son or not. Don't put your ass out the, there if you ain't ready. What is expected from Ooh, who, who's your that's, second round pick? Who's yeah, the second round pick on your team? Who's the second round pick on your team? And watch. And, 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 and watch hey. what no, Legend hey, and King Brandon. get on. Shit. Listen, Listen no, I don't step, give a fuck about that. Really that. That sounds really good. Who's the second round pick? Who's the second round pick on Milwaukee? That sounds really good. I guarantee you, you don't even know his name. I'm just asking. That sounds really good. I guarantee you, you don't even know his name. Woo! Tell me who's the second round pick on Milwaukee. You don't even know his name. Tell me who the second round pick was that got drafted with you. So you don't know his name, do you? Patrick Beverly. He got on the Milwaukee Bucks. No, he's, oh, you said, he's, he's oh, oh, on Jody Meeks. On the Bucks. Jody Meeks. Jody Meeks. Okay. What did they expect from Jody Meeks coming in training to camp? Come in there Nothing. Shoot. To come in there and shoot. Nothing. He was a shooter. Yeah. He, he had was a yeah. Cut, yeah. Yeah. Kentucky. Yeah. They, they, he was, they, he was a Kentucky. shooter. He was a shooter. That's what they wanted that to do. Baby. Come in there and I mean, shoot. How many minutes did he play? I don't know. I mean, he. You don't know because you don't remember. I don't, you don't know remember, what he played, but he went remember. to. He got, had no nobody remembers the second round pick. He played. There's no pressure on the second round pick. All right, all right. Let me know what in the right. history of basketball. All right. Let me know Yo where someone Yo like, ooh, Yo I can't wait to this second round pick get in the game. He about to average thirty. Bobo, Bobo, Tony Parker, Bobo, nobody. Tony Parker, Tony Parker is a first round pick. But who is it? Ginobili second round? Yeah, no, yeah, he got drafted. Fucking okay. Okay. He got drafted Isaiah two Thomas. years before Isaiah him. Thomas. Isaiah, Isaiah Thomas. Thomas was the 60th pick. Okay. Isaiah Thomas. Yeah. Pressure. Hmm. What pressure was it? There, pressure there was no, no pressure. No, I'm just pressure. saying in general. Oh, Isaiah I'm Thomas. just saying in general. Stop, man. I'm just saying Nobody in general, man. Y'all just making there excuses, that, bro. Because if, making if, excuses. If, if there was, there, if there was bro, you just so making much, excuses. You got if that. there was so much, if there was so much expectation. If my son ain't ready, he ain't ready. If there was so much expectation from a second round pick, then the motherfucker wouldn't have been a second round pick. Don't come into my lane. Nah, because if you fall in the second round. Because I ain't fighting for shit. 
Gil, you fall to the second round and you're projected first round. Go do some your, art, some your clothes. Your pressure comes from proving that you deserve to be a first round. Who? Go out name, there and embarrass me. Name a player. Name a embarrass player. Us. Name it a player in the second round that, that came into the season that the media was like, oh, he's about to be it. None. Never. Never. Nobody ever said that about Brody. Nobody ever said that about Brody. They're not saying that about Brody. Nobody said he's going to be the it factor. Nobody's saying, saying that about Brody. Like, who the said that? They're treating him as that, though. Treat him, him as what? What's his dad? Like, people expect and listen. Like, if Michael Jordan with 55, it'd be the same fucking thing. Nigga scored four points. I don't got a horrible game. If Michael Jordan's son got that, it'd the same three games. He scored four points. Shit. I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, like, no, but it took me like, three yeah. games to get four if points. If you average four points in college and you say I'm good enough to go to the league, you don't come to the league and then score four points again. Why not? Oh because you you feel like you I know somebody you didn't do it. I know you, somebody, you left because you said this four points ain't a reflection of different game. My I game. know somebody who ever sixteen Listen, points. Listen, man, if you throw your his son first, in his first game, he had two. Man, you throw your son in the fire. You throw your son in the fire. That's on his ass. Hey, I know somebody on the 10th pick. He was the 10th pick. That's on. Don't make excuses if you throw his ass in the fire. 10th pick scores zero. Nah. That did happen in this summer league. Of course. With no pressure, though. Niggas is grown. Niggas is grown, man. Niggas is grown, man. Niggas is grown, man. My dad is not who? The number 10 pick. My dad? The number 10 pick. 11 to 12 can go 0 for 12. Nobody will say nothing. This motherfucker go 2 for 12. We acting like, oh, he need to go back to college. Yeah, because we talking about him like he went number one. He only that's your problem. Games. No, that's the media. That's the whole point of <laughs> expectation. I'm not even sure about playing games. That's I'm just problem. trying to figure out like what, like, like what's your problem with what the media is saying. You know what's coming. You yes. put your, you the greatest player ever, and you put your son in the fire. You know what's coming. And we've been saying it. That's all I'm saying. No, you put him in the fire. He's not in the fire. That's the problem. He is in the fire. The problem is you get drafted in the NBA. You're in the fire. Facts. Nah, nigga, you're Facts. A, nigga, you you draft nah, anybody, any problem. number. You're in the fucking Facts. fire. Then why nobody in the fire? Who you are? Why nobody in the fucking fire, nigga? Why nobody? The top, the top ten picks have played, right? The top ten picks have played. Nobody cares. Exactly. Nobody cares. Of course, exactly. so that means so you you're, that the means the in the world. You threw, you're the greatest player in the world. You threw your son in the yeah. fire. That's all we care about. Tell me all what we hey, care about. We hey, want to know. We want to know. We gonna have something about. like hey, that. How much, hey, how when much you throw your son in the fire, they gonna want to make sure he's just how, like Lil Gil. How much? Yeah. Is the, how much if he not like Gil, how much did the fifty fourth pick score in summer league so far? No, I don't give a fuck. How much did the 56? Yeah, we don't give a fuck. Uh, we don't no give one gives that's not why we are here. That. That's, 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 that's not the topic of the conversation. That becomes a problem. I'm here to tell you right so now, because, we don't care. Because you got a problem with Braun, no, so no, you're trying no, to pick no, on the kid. No, yeah. nobody has yeah. a problem with Braun. It ain't Ron, the kid's fault. It ain't the kid's fault that my motherfucking daddy is LeBron James. I thought you said the kid makes his own decisions. But it ain't the kid's fault that he made his decisions. He made his decision. He came out. Bronny James can't help that LeBron James is his father. Exactly. And I'm not. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not right. complaining about that. He do what you gotta that. do for your son. But when you throw that, when That's you fire. throw him in the fire, okay. Who well, threw him in the fire? What time it is? The yeah. NBA is the fire. Yes. So that, there's no other league better then, than the NBA. Then, That's the fire. Then, then, Anybody then, that get drafted in the NBA, you play in the NBA, you're I'm, in the then, fucking fire. Then let's go on the record then. Uh oh. If you're media and you're crucifying the 55th pick. For playing like a 50 pick. pick. It, that, no, no, you're it's a not weak a ass. I you're yeah. a weak ass. I, I don't care about Do you know why they're crucifying? Because of who his dad is. That's what I'm saying. Is we know what's coming. No, 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 no. no. Because, because, you know. because it's Definitely easy know. content. No, it's it's easy content. You know damn well. Because you asked for it. You know damn well. Because you asked for it. Brody James is not going to score 20 in a summer league game. You know fuck. So it's easy picking. That's low then that means you're weak. Why is he not going to do that? Fruit. Why would he? Because no, that's low you're, right with it. you're making it, it easy. Oh you're making no, no, no. it easy for me to pick on your ass. Yeah. You're making it easy. He's Duh. a 50 pick. Why not? He's a 50 pick. Why not? Like so of course I'm not going to like it. Why can't you make it easy? Why can't you get 20 points? What was the most points you scored in a summer league game? That was the year after your rookie year. Any play any play the year in NBA. Go. What was the most? 10. Five, eight. What was it? I don't even know. I don't even know if I scored twenty. Yeah, he's not of worried about he that. He's worried about year five. No fucking second this, round this pick scored fucking 16. twenty points in the summer league game. Why, why can't Bronny though? Nobody. Why does he have? I don't care about, about the second pick. Why you can't hit him? Can he? I don't, no, he I don't can. care about. He's no. shooting the ball. When have we no. seen it? He's shooting the ball. Can he score twenty in a college game? 
Yo, listen, he I don't care how he could plays. It? I'm just talking about the facts of like, what you put your son into so, the fire. So, no, he put, it. listen, the kid wanted to go to the NBA, man. Listen, so this is the, so listen. It was his dream to hear his name so, called. Man, look, the kid had childhood dreams of playing the NBA. The opportunity presented itself for this kid to play in the NBA, mm -hmm. right? Yep. Whether his dad was still in the league or not, the kid's childhood dream was to play in the NBA. Every put kid himself that has in the NBA best situation. Put his kid in the best situation possible to get there, right? Facts. The kid is the fifty-fifth pick, right? Mm -hmm. There should be no expectation whatsoever with this kid. <laughs> Why? Because who is that? Why? Why? Who is that? Y'all even live with saying that? Because it's the truth. Is it you know there's pressure. No, it's pressure. No, it's pressure. From who? From who? All of us. No, 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 the world. No, 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 the world. Josiah, watching the, world. the world. game, Bronny no, shooting I'm the shot. Like, like you got to make that, Bronny. Y'all naive. Like, yeah, like we're watching the game for who? Because y'all are naive. What was we? Was we watching the Laker game? Y'all have we were the, the Bronny James Jr. We game. We were the Lakers were playing as well. Y'all play. have that's y'all. We were I, not watching the Lakers. That's y'all. But that's Any, what I, that's how I watched the Lakers. That's y'all. We were not watching the Lakers. I, so I, I was watching the Spurs last year. I was watching Wimby. I wasn't watching the Hornets. All those fans who came into the game that they were not there for the second game. They came to see Bronny and they yeah. bounced. Yeah, well, all the fans that's didn't the come to see the Spurs last year. They came to see Wimby. That's what y'all want to come with expectations. We're not expecting anybody. Yeah. I'm, I'm not. So this is that's the thing. That's what hype is. So this hype is, is the, no, 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 this is the thing. Everybody today said, you, you motherfuckers want instant gratification. You want to put the shit in the microwave and you want this motherfucker to be a 20-point score right now. Yes. Why? You do? Because... I want everybody who comes to the league. Oh, what no, you no, no. Oh, what no, you no, 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 they want the kid to come in right now yeah. and that, put him in the okay. microwave and they want a ready-made product okay. right now after fucking one, one summer league game. Yeah. If that ain't the case, man, Eight. the kid played, how many games the kid playing in college? 10, 12 games mm, in college, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? Was handicapped because of certain things. He is behind. He is behind. Why? K, KJ played more games than IMG and him. When KJ <laughs> went to IMG, he played more games than Bronny did his freshman year at USC. KJ came in his rookie year Still behind. Bronny is way behind in that aspect. Minutes matter on the floor, do they not? Right? Whether they in summer league, high school, college, your game experiences matter. The minutes that you spend, right? So you, you go to college, he's getting ready to go try to be a professional athlete. It was interrupted. Right? Mm -hmm. His DNA and everything said he has the potential to be an NBA player. It was his his time was interrupted. He is behind. No matter what y'all might see, he got drafted. Yes, he is behind. Mm -hmm. Damn near everybody that got drafted, far as minutes and on the floor activity. What he has and his advantage is that his daddy is LeBron James, being in that household, far as knowledge and all of that stuff. He has an advantage in that. But actual, what we're here to Judge him on is the actual games that he's playing. Mm -hmm. He is behind. So in any industry, specifically music, you bring somebody in. If you're an independent artist and we sign you, if I'm universal and we sign you, I need a ready-made project. If I, I so get you $4, dollars, no, I do not expect so a I need a ready-made project. No, that's Pride, not what I'm comparing. No. So he, he on some other shit. I'm not industry. on that. That's so not what I'm talking about. Any industry. So what's the nigga that made that's the, um, not what I'm talking about. Um, the fucking de is it fucking designer? What's the, the song the nigga made? Designer. Panda. 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 Yeah, yeah. Him. Yeah. Uh -huh. What else? He went. He was diamond. behind. He went diamond. He was behind. And then what else? What, what else? He didn't have to do shit. Yes. He went diamond. He was behind. The song went diamond. He was behind. Then what happened to his career? 
Jacking off on planes. That's his career. That's his career. That's how you know him. And that's the truth. He had a diamond album. Nigga, B Dog on the plane. No, he had a diamond album. No, he had a diamond song. He has a diamond song. He didn't get the. He didn't get 60 his first game. He didn't get a chance. He had 60 his first game. They put him in the microwave. 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 And what happened? Reality hit. He broke the record. That's just like Bronny James going out there hitting every shot. That's not reality. His royalties are forever. That's what it is. His royalties are forever. Hey, if you leave. Leave a bag of microwave popcorn in the motherfucking microwave too long. What the fuck happened it to it? Burns. It burns. So guess what? Let it burn. Like, that's what happened to design. That what you put is too fast, dog. How? Because he didn't get he a chance to diamond. build. Diamond. And then one song, song. bro. So, there's a lot of one hit wonders, bro. And he's one of them. Yeah, and he's going to eat forever. No, no. He is. no. peanuts. Ain't nobody I'm playing a song. Panda. Peanuts. 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 Y'all not know so music works. I know how he's getting peanuts. So what are royalties? Peanuts. Off of Panda. You're not getting peanuts off peanuts. of Panda. Yes, he's 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 he already got his money. The mic. But KJ, I got Hold on. Who gets their money first before him? Oh my God. The producers. Just, everybody. And, and, Who and, gets their money first? The label. The label. The label. So you see this motherfucking recent piece of merch, right? When you order a pizza, and by the time you get your pizza, to motherfucking seven people then took a motherfucking bite out of your slices. Uh, by the time you get it, that's this a fact. Is, that's a fact. He ain't getting the. He ain't getting the. He already got his money. The record, the record label has to recoup every dime before he see anything. They only recouping a dime off of a single. Exactly. They already been paid their no, money back. He ain't listen. He ain't he getting off peanuts. Of the single was so small. I can call somebody they got Def Jam. So we almost out of I time here. I can call somebody here. to work Hold for Def Jam Universal. I can call somebody to work for all of them. I've been in music in this even. I can call somebody right now to work for Def Jam Universal. She can explain it to me. We're almost out of time. Back to the moral of the story. We're almost out of time. Back to the moral of the story. We're almost out of time. Bronny James should be getting fucking criticized. You should not be expecting nothing from a 55th pick or any second round pick. Because they got picked in the second round for a reason. So we stop criticizing? Now, like somebody like Jokic, right? Nobody, people don't realize Jokic got drafted a year before he came in, he played one summer league game and they signed him to a four-year deal, right? The second round is we don't expect nothing from you Sorry, and if you do something good, we're going to glorify you. So, That's just how it is. So question, KJ, question for you. Obviously, you guys are in a unique experience with can you be in a number one overall pick? KJ, you being selected in the 50s in the second round similar to LeBron and Bronny. If you had the opportunity to play with your dad in the league, would you want to do that? Hell no. <laughs> See, that, why wouldn't you want? Why wouldn't you want to play with pops? I want to be around him every day like that. <laughs> well, hey, hey, what if you almost died though? <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah, <laughs> that's different. Yeah, what? We want to <laughs> maximize these moments. But like, I wouldn't. I don't know. But that's like, what I'm saying. But what if, like, like, no, 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 if it was on the Lakers? No, 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 no. Now you said what you that's said. That's weird. If you question. had a chance to play with that's your son. Question. Yes. Yeah, fuck yeah. That's exactly what was going on. Fucking Bronze, right. yes. The son is like, yeah, I just want to play. Yeah. It's but, two different narratives. But what the narrative that we're escaping is the fact that they already said we never had conversations about No, they doing probably this. didn't. We never until we, it presented we, we, we. itself. Yeah. It presented itself when he was a McDonald's no, All American. No, no. When he was a Shop. McDonald's All American, I could potentially Shop. play with my kids. Shop. Who's playing this long? LeBron Raymond James Sr. Like, and Vince who Carter. In, who in our game? You, it's five guys that played 20 years. Mm. Five mm -hmm. that played 20 fucking years. Mm -hmm. That they weren't having that conversation, man, about playing with his son Let me ask until you it presented itself. Who, who, who's, who's a better player? Zaire Wade or Bronny James? Hmm? Bronny James. One's in the NBA. And Bronny why is Zaire not in the NBA? Cause he, he didn't have the same. He wasn't as good when when it was time. He you know, you know, no, no, I saw him no, playing no. high school. So what happened with what happened was Zaire. I saw him playing high school. Yeah, remember, he was in, he was in, he was in he was in Florida, right? No. He came here. This was a different experience Gil. from him. He had a different lifestyle when he Gil. first got here as a Gil. as a as a as a player. Gil. Damn all the tap man shit. Listen, when they was being judged and all that shit things as at the time, Bronny was better than Zaire. Probably. He was. I saw no, him play. Okay. Yeah, no, no. What I ain't saying Zaire couldn't play, but Bronny was better at the time. At the time. But what happened was when Zaire. He got hurt. When Zaire got hurt. And, and then Canyon. he had to go to another school. He had to go to. He had to, he had to go to. He went to Sierra Canyon, got hurt, and didn't motherfucking play right. a lot. And then, then he had to go. He didn't get the scholarship and all that. He didn't, he didn't get the scholarship. Had, so then he had to go somewhere different. And what, just, now, so. that experience where he realized everybody else was going to college and he had to go play another year of high school ball. 
that turned him into something different. Then he didn't take the game serious. Then he started practicing three times a day, right? So he caught the end of what it takes to be a player. Yeah, but don't you know that the first real story of father son plan was Dwayne and Zaire? It could have been. That was the it was been. the first one. So it why? Could have been. But why wasn't because, it? Because what I'm saying is Zaire because himself was, took it yes. serious at a later time. He took it serious because he was 17 when he graduated. So he went to school to get. So you're talking about 18 years old when he's like, oh shit, this is what it is. Then he started training and really taking that serious. Before when he first came to LA, Zaire was chilling. Yeah. Cause I was chilling. I was going to the games, bro. Listen, he was chilling. It, was it wasn't. Gone, it, it wasn't was the basketball year. then. So, going to watch the games. So it wasn't. Look, it wasn't basketball for him like that. His basketball, him. his basketball. His basketball. When he felt, yeah, yeah. When, when when he lost the opportunity to go uh, to a college and he had to go to uh, prep school, and then it's like, oh shit, yeah. this is real. Then he started training and training. Then he got. Then he got a little. Then he got a lot better. 